Hi, this topic is called shopping all around the world. And as you see, it's something that girls love to do. Well, most of us at least. So I'm going to be sharing with you some vocabulary about shopping and things that will be useful if you were go to the store to buy clothes. At the shop, you can talk to the salesperson, try on clothes, and you need to find the right size, your, your size. You don't want it to be too big, too small, too long, or too short. It needs to be just right. Expressions that you can use to show that you like something, you can say, this is nice. Or you might want to ask, what size is it in? You might want to ask the sales lady the size because you want to try it on. Or you can also say, that's lovely. Ways to show that you don't like it are, I don't like it. Because it's hideous, which means it's ugly. It's too small or too big. Too cheap, it doesn't cost enough money. Or too expensive. To buy or not to buy, that is a great question. Something that's important to know is that when you go shopping, you say, you can say, I want to buy a pair of blue pants, jeans, skirt, a shirt, a top. Or you can pay for jeans, pants, skirt, or a top. It's important to recognize that the word for is very, very essential when saying to pay for. You, I buy blue pants, but I pay for blue pants. I buy a small t-shirt, but I pay for a small t-shirt. And when talking about the price, to know how much does it cost, you want to ask how much does it cost to know the price of the item you're buying. And to be sure that you have proof of your purchase, you need to ask for the receipt. Can I have the receipt, please? Let's look one more time at the vocabulary that we can see at the mall or at a shop. At the shop, I can talk to a salesperson, try on clothes, and I have to find the right size. It's not too big, it's not too small, it's not too long, and it's not too short. It's just my size. And then these are words to show that you like something or that you don't like something. And remember, we buy things or we pay for them. Why not to go shopping with Renona Ryder? I don't know if you've heard, but yeah, she thought she shoplifted. And she could get since she gets sent to jail. Shoplifting is when you steal something or take something without paying for it. Let's review the vocabulary that we've seen in this section. These are all words that can be very useful when going shopping and when we can go all around the world. A salesperson, which is a sales lady if it's a man or a salesman, if a sales lady if it's a lady or a salesman if it's a man. Lovely, a receipt, to try on, big versus small, short versus long, to pay for and to buy, or to purchase. These are all words to show that you have purchased something or obtained something. A purchase is the item that you actually purchase. And in Winona Ryder's case, case, she didn't actually purchase it. She stole it because she shoplifted. Maybe it was just too expensive for her. And here are some key expressions that can help us when shopping. That's nice. That's hideous. I like this dress. I don't like that at all. I need a smaller size. I need a larger size. What size is it? How much does it cost? Can I have a receipt, please? 
I hope you enjoyed this topic, and please tune in for our next one, which is Don't Let the Queen of England Boss You Around. See you later. Bye-bye.